Dry Side Kitties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Pete the cat, so let's get started. To draw this cute cat, let's first start by drawing a curve for the top of the head. So let's come right here and I'm just going to draw a soft curve right across. Then from there, I'm going to come in a little bit, see about here and here. And I'm going to go up for an angle line to draw the ears nice and high. And say about right there, I'm going to bring this down, coming down at a slight angle. So same thing over here. Go up these cat ears, about the same height on the other side, and come back down at a slight angle. So now that we have the ears in, let's bring this down. So we're still kind of going at an angle a little bit. Or you can come straight down, it's really up to you. I want to give it more of a angle, so I'm just going to bring this out a little bit more. And say about right there, I'm going to go ahead and connect. So I'm going to connect it with a curve at the bottom. Or if you like, you can make it a little bit sharper towards the center. And go up. There. So that's just the shape we're trying to aim for. Pretty angular, right? <laughs> okay, so then from there we're going to draw the eyes. Let's find our center, so uh, about right here, and I'm going to come out on both sides and just give myself two points right there. These two points I'm going to use to draw the eyes. So this is nice and center. I'm going to come right here and come across with a curve that slightly goes downwards all the way across. So same thing over here. All the way towards the edge. And then from there we're just going to go ahead and connect this curve. Nice and big and low. And up. And same thing over here. And up. There. And then let's come back in here and we're going to draw another curve, like a circle, but not all of it, about that much. And I'm going to come in here and just draw another one. So this is the white and this is all going to be black. Nice and thick. So same thing on this side. So about right here. And once again, the white, and shade this all in. And obviously, if you're drawing much smaller than I am, you would just thicken that line that you draw for the eyes. Then from there, I'm going to come over here and just thicken the top to anchor these eyes. Make it more prominent. And same thing over here. Okay, so now we have Pete's eyes in. Let's go draw his nose, which is basically a triangle, right? So right in between the eyes, I'm just going to start off with a soft curve right in the center and go ahead and just connect it to create this triangle. There. And his whiskers, of course. So on the side right here, I'm just going to go ahead and just draw four of them. There. And same thing over here. And sometimes make it longer, shorter, just to break it up. And we have Pete's head in. Now let's draw his body. So I'm going to come right to the center and say about right here and here. And give myself two points for his neck. And I'm going to bring this down, curve it out. And this part right here, I'm just going to come down a little bit, giving him a neck. And then I'm going to go across with a line. So go all the way across to about, say, right here. I'm just going to make him that big. There. And then from there, I'm going to go ahead and, well, let's come back here. So we're going to come down, bring this curve down. 
You're just kind of angling out. And then in the center, about right here, we're going to start, and I'm going to start about right here, kind of find his body. I want it about this thick. So say about right here. I'm going to go ahead, and this is going to follow this curve. And this one part right here is just going to go across, and then I'm going to come down. So just a small little curve. And right here to draw his other leg. So let's bring this down, curving it out, curve it out, and then this is going to come down. So I'm going to bring this one down lower. This one right here to about right there, and I'll cut it off. And let's see, I'll wait for that one, then let's come back and draw the tummy area. So I'm just continuing this curve, going slightly upwards. And let's come back over here. So about this area, I'm going to go up to draw Pete's tail. Go up nice and high. And about right here, I'll just stop and curl in, round it off, come back out and down so we get a little bit thicker as we come down back right there so then about right here i'm going to start to draw the back so just come down with a line and we want it to end about the same area as this side so let's bring this down a little bit more about right there and then in this area just like this we're going to come say about right here same thickness as the front and draw this leg i'm going to come out angle draw the other leg so about the same thickness all right there and then whatever space you have left go ahead and connect so just like this side right here, we're going to go ahead and connect. Then let's come back and draw these awesome shoes. So I'm going to come right here and pop out a curve. And I'm going to pass this leg, so nice big shoe, so about right here. The back of our shoes. And I'm going to go ahead and just connect it at the bottom. So same thing over here. Come out. And I'm just going to aim to make it about the same size, about right there. And once again, the back. And you just want to make sure you're at the same level and connect. There. So then now we can draw the back. So uh, let's bring it down a little bit more. And about right there, go ahead. And once again, just like the front, come down and right there and connect. So same thing over here. So we have the shoes in and let's draw some details. So um, the bottom first, draw a curve. Then come right here, break it up. And then the laces. I'm just going to simplify it and just draw three of them. So they're going to be this way and then as I come up on this part, I'm just going to go the other way. So same thing on all the shoes. And one more, and here. Last but not least, of course, <laughs> we're going to have to add a heart. So I'm going to put it right here and make it my draw so cute, Pete the cat. 
and we're all done and I really hope I made this fun and easy for you to follow along with me and if you loved it and I helped you out please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new draw secure videos see you later